Hi guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for coming in and stopping by. In today's video, I'm going to share with you the pros and cons of the iLife B5S Pro Vacuum Robot. So let's start off with the pros. As a mom of a very active toddler, I like that my cleaning time is shorter because of the fact that the iLife B5S Pro can work both as a vacuum cleaner and as a mop. So it saves a lot of time when it comes to cleaning our floor. Second, I noticed that the sound of the vacuum is low. That is why it was still possible for me to have Zoom meetings even when it was vacuuming and doing its job. Third, I think we were lucky that our furniture have wide legs so the vacuum can easily pass through it with the breeze. Fourth, I like that it can climb up the base of the electric stand fan and clean it because it is an area that is often neglected when cleaning an electric fan. Fifth, the remote control feels premium and not flimsy. It actually feels and looks like a remote control for air conditioners, so that's a plus. Sixth, you can access the clean mode with the remote control, but you can also press the clean button on the vacuum if your remote is low back. Seventh, the robot vacuum suction is very good because it can really get even the smallest dirt on our tiles, especially hair. Eight, I like the features of the remote where you can choose spot cleaning, edge cleaning, and even set a cleaning schedule via the timer. Ninth, I like that it is able to navigate itself back to its charging pad when it's low bat. It also looks chic with its gold and white aesthetic. Tent, it has an effective sensor so it can detect if it's located near areas where it can fall like stairs. So you don't need to worry about that. Now for the cons of the iLife B5S Pro. First, since we have a low profile sofa, the robot vacuum cannot clean under it. So I need to move the furniture aside so that the robot vacuum can access the dirt underneath. Second, if you have a small kitchen mat or rug, it can get tangled with it. So I need to uh, remove the kitchen mat beforehand. Third, the dustbin of the iLife B5S Pro is smaller than other robot vacuums. So you may need to empty the dustbin often. Fourth, it doesn't have the linear navigational pattern for cleaning, meaning it cleans randomly and sometimes repeats passing over the same area, but it cleans the whole floor nonetheless. Fifth, for those who prefer accessing the robot vacuum using an app, then this model is not for you because it doesn't have the mobile app feature, so you will not have the option to connect this to any virtual smart assistant like Google or Alexa. Overall, the iLife B5S is indeed value for money because it is able to do the job quite well. I can say that they are, uh, I can say that there are more pros than cons when it comes to this product. So if you are looking for a good quality robot vacuum that doesn't break the bank, then go for the iLife B5S Pro Robot Vacuum Cleaner. 
And that's it. I hope I was able to properly show you the pros and cons of the iLife V5S Pro Robot Vacuum. Again, please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe.